Hello and welcome to our channel. In this tutorial you will learn how to make a parallax effect in Photoshop. The parallax effect, also known as 2.5D, is an effect where we have multiple layers moving at different speeds to give our image a 2.5D depth. It does yield a very good looking video at the end. In this tutorial we'll quickly skim over how to assemble our layers together, but we'll mainly address the timeline feature that will help us animate everything to make it look great. You may want the graphics to be slightly bigger so we can animate parts of it without showing the edge of the layer. When we're thinking of parallax, one thing that's important is to have a separate background and foreground layers. In our case, we'll be using a few different assets such as the background, the foreground subject and a few layers of snow that have been found on the internet. Since we'll be exporting video at the end, it's a good idea to work in a video resolution and ratio. 1920 by 1080 should work great for this purpose. Once we have everything layered up, we'll go to Windows and select Timeline. Click Create Video Timeline. Make sure the playhead is all the way to the left. Now click on the drop down icon on the very bottom layer and click on the stopwatch next to Position or Transform. Move your layer to the far left edge. Next move the playhead ahead a little and move the layer to the right side. You can click Play to preview your animation. Let's do the same with the other layers, except the closer the layer to the camera is, the more it should move. When done, you should have layers that all move but at different rates. The further the layer from the lens, the slower it should move. Adjust the length of the animation by dragging the out point to where you need it. Go to File. Export. Render video. Here you can name the file, select the folder for output and finally select a preset for the video render. We'll choose YouTube HD 1080p. Click Render. It may seem quite a tedious task, but the end result is worth it. What do you plan on adding parallax effect on? If you liked this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel and make sure to press the bell button to be the first to know about our new videos.